on Twitter, but you really don't know how to tweet, and you're having a hard time figuring it out, well, guess what? If you're on Instagram, you can share your post over to Twitter. Yep, today I am gonna show you how to share a post from Instagram to Twitter so that you can get more followers on Twitter and get more followers on, you got it, Instagram. If you haven't already started sharing your Instagram post to Twitter, you definitely should. Twitter has a huge user base and people in your audience on Twitter will be different from those on Instagram. There are two ways that you can do this. Right now we are on my featured account, The Daily IG, the.daily.ig. And I created this account because I was at Social Media Marketing World in San Diego um, 2014 as a speaker and I met so many amazing speakers, leaders, authors, entrepreneurs, and I really wanted to celebrate the content that they were sharing from the stage to other people. So every one of these posts is done in my favorite third-party app, Word Swag, and I'm basically giving shout outs to other people who create great quotes. Now this one's from Chris Brogan, and if you click on who I tagged, it takes you right over to their account. This is Ian Cleary, both who are good friends of mine and who um, I had the pleasure of being with at Social Media Marketing World. Occasionally, I will do quotes from people that truly inspire me, Marie Forleo, and of course, Ted Rubin was at Social Media Marketing World, Martin Shervington, and I'm tagging them so that it brings you over to their account. So it's giving a shout out to other people. I am basically broadcasting the value of content that others give and sharing it on Instagram. And I am happy to say that my conversion rate on this account is almost 10 to 1. So I've posted 68 times here and there's over 600 followers. So I like that conversion rate a lot, 10 to one, 10 new followers for every post. And I think a lot of it has to do with the fact that people love daily doses of inspiration and they really um, can relate to a lot of the quotes that are put here. Now, when you share a post from Instagram to Twitter, so let me go into Ann Clary's post here. Um, you wanna go down where the three little magic dots are, I call them the magic dots that take you to the back end. So you click on that and you have the option on the second one down to share the photo. So when you share the photo to Twitter, and now it's blue, when you tap on it, it turns blue. If we were to share it to Facebook, it would turn, oh, I have to link it because I have so many accounts, it just has to quickly link. So you can, if you were to share it to Facebook, it would link and turn blue, but we're only gonna share it to Twitter right now. So. What you can do is go in there and edit what you said on Instagram so it makes sense for Twitter. And Ian is, I don't want it to have the word swag, Ian is also Razor Social on Twitter. Oops. So we want to change the hashtag to the at mention and I want to delete this part above. So again, you, can, you want to edit, um, especially if you are going to be sharing over to Twitter. So we don't want to start the tweet with an at mention. Um, so I'm going to just select and I'm going to copy and I'm going to just paste it right in front. Oops. Showing you my, my little workarounds. Um, and now we're just going to delete this. Select. I am on an iPhone and, um, okay, t top social media site globally, Ian Clary is an industry leader. Okay, so let's just, after that, we can put blog, because um, he's a blogger and he just has an awesome, you definitely want to subscribe to his newsletter, Razor Social, it's awesome. So I'm just showing you literally how to edit. This isn't the best tweet, but it's it, it gives you the idea of changing the description, putting in the right hashtags, we can add social media, and you don't want to put in more than two hashtags. Now on Instagram, you can put up to 30 um, per post. And I'm not saying that you should be doing that either. But I'm saying when you share over to Twitter, you really just want to share um, at mention the right account. Make sure that the same account 
name exists on Twitter that it does on Instagram. And the way for you to check that out usually is to go to someone's website and look for the social share button and confirm that you are at mentioning the right user. A lot of people do not have the same name matched up. So you want to check that for sure. And then you share. So it simply goes over to Twitter and it's shared there. Now, another way to share Instagram pictures is to go in to your camera roll where I have way too many photos. I keep all of mine handy. <laughs> You'll see there's over 7,000. I know, call me crazy. I've got to get them in Dropbox. Okay, so here are some branded tips, Instagram tips that I have created. And they all look the same. They're all done in Word Swag. And so when you share from an image from your camera roll, the real estate that it takes up on Twitter is greater. It shows the whole image on Twitter. So what I would do here is just share the image to Twitter. And I'm going to talk to Siri again. Instagram tip. And I'm going to hashtag the word Instagram. I'm going to put it in my AirPlay password so that we can do this. I must have typed it wrong. So Instagram tip. And then I'm going to lead people to my website. And I have it as a bit.ly so I can track it. SBZ website. Um, and I'm just going to say great Instagram tip. So this is going to show up as a image on Twitter, not as a link. When you share from Instagram, it shows up as a link that people need to click on to see the Instagram image. When you share directly from your photos, it shows up as that image. So I am an avid Twitter, tweeter. Um, I love to tweet, but I'm also looking for more tips. So I would love it if you leave your best Twitter tip in the comments below. And I've also linked my video on sharing to Facebook below. So make sure that you've seen that one as well for the best strategies for cross promoting. And since that notification just went up, I will tell you that I recently checked out the app. Um, I downloaded the app Photogram and I'm just checking it out and that's what you saw pop up. So that's another Instagram app where you can track the engagement that you're having on Instagram. So you just got a bonus tip in my video because that notification just popped up. So go ahead, leave your comments below. I look forward to hearing from you. Sending you hashtag love. Did you like this video? Please subscribe. And come on over to Instagram, my favorite social media platform, where you can follow me at the Instagram expert and use the hashtag Subi Zimmerman, and I will be sure to see your post and follow the conversation.